think we'll start with um, th thoughts on the performance, really. Um, I thought uh, first half, I thought it was a pretty even game and I thought maybe we might have even just shaded it, to be honest. We had two or three very good opportunities um, and I thought we played OK. Uh, we looked pretty dangerous. Uh, you know, We showed a good reaction to going 1-0 down early um, by coming back and going 2-1 in front. And then, you know, disappointing to concede a corner, um, you know, a set piece goal for the second. But I thought we'd done okay. I didn't think it was a poor performance first half. But I've got to say, I didn't think the second half performance was good enough from us. I thought we were poor. I thought Western deserved it second half. I thought we, for the first 20, 25 minutes of the second half, we couldn't get a foothold in the game at all. We couldn't get hold of the ball. Western were sort of, you know, sharper to it. And uh, I thought the second half of performance was poor from us. And that wasn't good enough. And I've got to take responsibility for that as the manager. Um, um, and uh, I was disappointed with, with that with that second half. I think we still have one or two sort of opportunities that they sort of presented to us, really, um, which we were, couldn't manage to take. But you can't concede four goals and expect to get something from the game. And when you look at some of the goals we've conceded today, you know they've been extremely poor. Um, I thought our recovery run in for the first goal we conceded that ended up with the Doka giving away a penalty, you know, was poor and we exposed him a little bit and, you know, showed his inexperience there. Um, you know, and then, uh, say, set piece corner, you know, that was the routine from them that we got done on uh, to make it two. Third goal's a free kick again that we switched off a little bit, you know, header at the far post. And then the fourth goal was just a, you know, a calamitous sort of error from us. And uh, I was very disappointed with our second half performance. We've got to do better than that. And, um, you know, that's the way I see it. How do you make those changes? I mean, you know, you've got just a handful of games left and, and teams chasing behind you that, that want to get out of relegation as much as you want to stay out of relegation. Yeah, I think um, I, I, I think uh, we've got to keep cool heads. You know, I'm disappointed today, you know, uh, as a staff. We, we feel quite angry today, but we've got to keep cool heads. I mean, uh, you know, we've got a game at home to Bogner um, next um next Saturday and I believe they might have been relegated today Bogner so you know it's still in our hands I thought as I say first half we did okay second half wasn't good enough but sometimes you know maybe we do show a little bit of inexperience I think I'm right in saying that we had five possibly six players out there today 21 and under you know, so it's a very young side. If you go through the side, Craig King, 21, Adoka, 17, Freddie, sort of 21, Kevin Cotter, 20, Sam Nombe, 19. You know, we have a lot of young players out there and uh, perhaps that showed at times. And to, particularly today's uh, first half, you know, we're guilty of perhaps trying to overplay at times. And, you know, maybe uh, I don't think Western sort of back unit is their strongest point of the, the side and at times we turned down opportunities to play the ball forward and ended up sort of getting caught on it. I mean if you look at the way we started the, the second half that basically sort of summed us up for a little bit for that period. I mean it was our own kick off and we went sort of sideways we went to a doka, we went sort of a, a across the side, across the pitch then Joe Osler has gone on a run and lost it uh, and then we ended, ended up giving a free kick right on the edge of our box that Craig's done well to, top, to tip over the crossbar you can't start the second half like that and then that for 20 minutes of that start that second half that was that you know we couldn't get hold of it we they were better than us and I think they deserved it there you know I'd always try and give an honest assessment disappointed with that with that uh, that performance really overall it's such a crucial stage of the season for us um, and it's made the result even worse by the fact that Paul have won today so you know we've now got four games to go we're still not mathematically safe but you know I think it's uh, you know time to keep cool look at how we can prepare for Bogner We've got a home game that, you know, if we get that result at home, you know, we'll be safe. So, but yeah, I, I know I keep sort of saying it, but uh, not good enough second half. Do you often look back at some of those chances? I know you've talked to me a lot about the fact that it's not about luck, it's about creating chances. Mm. But there were a couple of times out there that you really should have taken the lead. Yeah, I think so. As I say, I thought first half we was OK. Uh, Matt Patterson had a couple, didn't he? You know, in the start, Rob Sinclair wriggled in and set it back. Sort of a good block, to be fair, then another block. And then uh, Matt's had another one. Uh, yeah, so I, think, I thought, um, you know, as I say, you, you, I, you're not going to take every chance you create. I think we do have to be more clinical at times. But I think the problem for us today wasn't so much the top of the pitch. I thought, um, you know, you can't come away from home and can see four goals, can you, and expect to get anything from the game. You know, you give yourself an absolute mountain to climb. Uh, and to be fair to the boys at the back, you know, and us as a team in general, we, we've looked reasonably solid, to be fair, at the, at the back. Really. But today, you know, it's a very open game. I think you have to give credit to Western. They do play like that. 
that. You know, they're a very good football inside, particularly at home on a good pitch like this. They're, you know, they make the pitch very big. They try to play, and it is difficult. It's not easy. I'm not saying that. And at times we struggle to get the, to get uh, to grips with their movements and things like that. Uh, but perhaps we just got to you know stick at it a little bit more, make the game a little bit more scrappy. Uh, but we, that's not us really. You know, we're a football inside ourselves. We've come here today and tried to play an open game uh, and come off the wrong end of it. Uh, you know, maybe we got to just be a bit more solid, scrap it out. You get a sort of ugly point here away today, and you know you think, well, that's not you know it's another point for us. But that's not us, as I say. We've come here today. We've been open. We've tried to play. We've tried to match them, and it's a uh, you know. I'm sure for the, uh, the the neutral in the ground, it was a pretty good, entertaining, open game. But uh, they were better than us second half. Brilliant. Thank you for that. That's Thank great. You. Thank you so Cheers. much.